Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel. This is a get ready with me. Um, I didn't know what look I was going for, but I know I wanted to film, so this is the outcome. Um, if you like what I have on right now, then please keep watching. For the under eyes, for the dark circles, I'm going in with the City Color Photo Chick. It's a dark spot corrector. I absolutely love this stuff for dark eyes. Coastal Sense just concealer brush. Just looks like that. And I just start by my inner tear duct and just kind of like bring it downwards and then somewhat like a triangle shape underneath my eyes. So the next step is our foundation, two different foundations. And the first one I'm taking is Clinique's Beyond Perfecting 3-in-1 Concealer, or foundation, whatever it's called, in the color 8, which is golden neutral. And then the next one is this Estee Lauder Double Wear in the color 2C3 Fresco. So I'm just going to put that all over my face. this beauty blender and just blend everything out. Alright, so now we're done with foundation. We're moving on to eyebrows, but I'm actually just going to film it off camera really quick um, so my camera can charge while I'm just doing them. But I just want to let you guys know what I'm using. So I'm using this L'Oreal Paris Brow Stylist Definer. It's dark brunette and it's equivalent to um, dark brown from Anastasia Brow Wiz. And the, I think this is like number six for the benefit one. To set, I'm just using this Anastasia Clear Brow Gel. So yeah. All right, these two, and I'll be right back. Um, I forgot to mention to you guys, um, as like the underbrow highlight, I just took my uh, Benefit Highbrow. It's probably backwards, but whatever. And just this Coastal Sense concealer brush to blend it out. Going in with this Tarlette and Bloom palette with their all over color Smarty Pants right here. We're going in with the Mario palette. Isabel, this orange one right here, and this is going to be our transition shade, and we're just going in with our Luxie uh, 205 uh, crease brush. Going back with our Tartlet, Tartlet and Bloom, we're going in with the color Firecracker, which is that. We're going, we're going to use the same brush we used for our first lid color, the Sephora one, and just put that all over our lid. So I just put on some falsies. I put the Kiss Ritzy ones. So it's like a natural-ish type of um, lash. So yeah, and then also I use this uh, Maybelline the Colossal Big Shot mascara as well before I put my lashes on and then after just to kind of blend it. So to blend in like the lining underneath, I'm going in with this ColourPop gel liner in black and then just underneath my waterline. So next we're going underneath for our eyes and we're going in with the Shape Tape in the color Light Neutral. Looks like this. And I just bought this the other day and I really, really, really like it. And it smells really good. But yeah, so a little bit goes a long way by the way. And the lady told me it like dries out quickly. So just do one um, eye first. So there's this brush from Coastal Scents. Um, it's the BRB SO7 brush. And it looks like this. It's kind of like an angled kabuki brush. But I saw Casey Holmes do this and I really like the way it turns out. So you just kind of like blend from the top of your inner tear duct and blend all the way down lightly. And it's okay if you get it on your nose as well like this. Because then you're highlighting, you're doing like two in one <laughs> in a way. So blend that, and then you're slowly going to bring it all out. And 
and also like a little trick too so once you do your shadow you can just clean it up by just making a straight line And it doesn't have to be blended perfectly all the way with this little brush because you're going back with the beauty blender, which I'm about to do in a second. Alright. FX. This is a little cream contour palette. And going in with the color 4, which is right here. We're going in with our Sephora airbrush crease uh, concealer brush. CA Secret Brightening Powder. For our cheeks, we're going in with the Kat Von D Shade to Light Palette. And we're taking Subconscious, which is this one right here, and Shadow Play. And I like to mix these. The brush that we're using for it is our Sephora, what number is this? 79 brush. So now that's done, we are taking our e.l.f. blending brush and just um, making the, the contour not that harsh and then just wiping away the excess powder. For our highlight, I'm doing like a cream base first and then uh, put a powder over it. So I'm taking this Becca Skin Shimmery Skin Perfector. And going in with Becca's Opal. Opal. Going in with this L'Oreal lip palette. This darkest color right here. And that is cream. The last one I put was this little tart one. Um, at least setting spray. So we're just taking Maybelline's Master Fix. All right, and that completes the look. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, please feel free to leave any comments down below. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me down on social media. Everything will be down in the description box. So yeah. Um, that's all I have for you guys, so until next time, I'll see you in my next video. Bye!